Welcome to the uh, GoDaddy Website Builder tutorial. Um, in this tutorial, we're going to show you how to add, edit, delete pages. Um, it's uh, very intuitive, very simple. Um, you can see here on our draft uh, website, um, at the moment we've got a home page, a services page, and a contact us page. And that's replicated here, home, services, contact. Um, we've also got a privacy policy here, but you'll see this has a little gray icon next to it uh, with a line through it, which basically means that um, this page, uh, in terms of its settings, um, we're showing it in the footer, but we're not showing it in the navigation. Now I could change that. I could click on show in navigation and it will appear here. Um, uh, but it would be normal to have a privacy policy linked to from, from the footer. So I'm just going to leave it there for the time being. Um, now, uh, if I want to reorder pages, that's very simple. I go to this icon here, reorder pages, click on it. And then I could move, for instance, the services page down below the contact us um, or vice versa. Um, Move it all around as you see fit. Once you're happy with it, you can click done. Um, now, obviously, we can add or delete pages. Um, so I'm going to show you that process now. If I click here on add a page, I'm going to create a new page, which is going to be called uh, gels. Uh, I'm a barbers, and I may well want to sell gels. Um, uh, so I'm going to put this in my nav bar uh, and I click on create page. And you'll see that gels appears here uh, on the navigation bar. Um, now, there may be other pages that I want to add. So let's add um, hair care products. Uh, I have an intention to sell hair care products. So I'm going to put that in the nav as well. Um, and so that's all very simple and easy to use. If I want to go and look at a specific page, I just click on it here and the page will appear here in the, the, the main body area. Um, now it may well be that actually what I want to do is I want to group my products. Um, so I might want to create a, a page which has uh, sub pages below it. So in this instance, I'm going to create a drop down menu and I'm going to call it products uh, for sale. And the pages that I'm going to put under there are gels and hair care products. So I've selected those two pages, which will appear below that menu title. I'm happy with that. So I'm going to click create menu. So now I've got products for sale with options below. Um, so hopefully that all makes sense and is very simple to understand. Um, the other uh, thing that I could do is I can link out to other websites. Um, so um, I may want to link to a, a, a hair care provider or uh, maybe a, a brand. Um, so I'm going to choose, let's have a look and find a website to link out to. Uh, so Aventi, let's have a look at Aventi. Aventi.com. I want to link through to these guys. It may be that I'm setting up some kind of affiliate scheme. Um, so in this instance, I'm going to put a Venti. Um, that's going to be my page title. Nope, sorry, go to link to external website, link title, Venti. And I'm going to put the URL in there then create a link. Now actually in this instance, I'm going to link through to this from the footer rather than the navigation bar. It's a little unorthodox to link through to external websites from, from, from your uh, navigation bar. Um, so I'm going to put that there and create the link. And now what we should be able to see in our footer is a link through to Eventi. So it's very, very easy to create drop downs, reorder pages, create pages. And if I'm not happy or I want to change something, I can literally go here and just delete the link. I'm going to delete that link. I don't actually want the products for sale anymore. Now, if I delete this one because it's a folder, let's show you. Uh, if I delete that from the menu, the 
gels and hair care products will appear. Um, but I've decided now I don't want to sell products, so I'm going to get rid of those. Um, and I'm going to revert back to my original structure. So that is how you add it and edit, add pages, delete pages, edit pages in the GoDaddy uh, website builder.